Oh, well, I've just, I've just completely blown myself away because when I did this little, like, little Lemurian, my hair is so jacked today. <laughs> when I did this Lemurian reading, I like knew that I initially had six cards and not five. So I found the other one that was missing. And this just had to blow my mind because it's the card for ether. And which is the fifth element, the heavens. And so it pertains to this earth angel. It's pretty amazing. But what this card has to say is ether, the seamless unspeakable. It's quintessence. Why do I have a hard time saying that? Quintessence. <laughs> Quintessence. Um, e ether, the seamless, unspeakable. And I thought about like being a seamstress and making clothes as well when I first saw this card. And then it like disappeared when I read the other ones. Maybe it's meant to have its very own video here um, with my northern lights in the back, which I still got to switch it to May and see what beautiful picture you'll we'll look at there. Ether, the seamless, unspeakable. I can say it again and again. The seamless, unspeakable, the fifth element, the heavenlies, the heavens. <sighs> All right. This illuminated, and look at, you can tell, that's just like an angel right there. Look at, historically accurate. Sea dragon angel with all the eyes. And look at how, it's just like, look how heavenly the card is. It's beautiful. This is for all earth angels, all my earth angels. This illuminated space of no distraction and pure potential is beyond the threshold. It is the centered and present place where all dreams are birthed. From here, you can choose where to go. What may be perceived as endless nothingness is the illuminated eternal, the core that all fears may be peeled back to. Step through the distance and realize it is only a short distance from the white void at the center of creation. Okay, short distance were the words that um, jumped out to me when I just glanced at this. The, the first two words I saw was short distance, meaning that it is close, that heaven is close. New heaven and new earth is closer than we think, closer than we think. Like here, I am ready. I receive that. It wouldn't be a moment too soon because, <laughs> you know, you know the story. <laughs> No matter though all their plots and ploys and tricks and plans have failed, they're desperate. They're so desperate. And um, I always trust God with my life anyways, but it's, it's, I've been in this scary situation before, but yeah. Anyways, I'm not going to give too much information I've got. I'm going to make it. My records say that I make it. <laughs> my records say that I achieve it. So anyways, um, okay, where were we? Step through the darkness and realize it's only a short distance from the white void at the center of creation. Herein lies the feeling you may have been striving to meet. Herein <laughs> lies the feeling that you may have been striving to meet, yet subconsciously running from... <laughs> oh my God, tripping out. In graceful surrender. <laughs> you look like such a dark. <laughs> oh no. I look like somebody I've been seeing on my shards. I don't want to do that too much. All right. Stop it, Sally. Don't disgrace the graceful moment we're in right now. Herein lies the feeling you may have been striving to meet as subconsciously running from in graceful surrender. No, you are held and drop deeper into existence and graceful surrender know that you are held and drop deeper into existence i am really excited to see what's just around the corner excited to get back what was stolen me excited for things to change for the better and for that all that i've been through and those also that have been through the worst for us all to know that it wasn't all worth nothing. 
that there was an extreme reason they were desperately trying to hide our existences and whatnot. Oh, they've been desperate to hide my existence, my aliveness, my identity. Gotta be a real big reason why there.